What's up guys, this is my first ever airsoft gameplay video of commentary. This is a CQB area in Hong Kong with all sorts of compact areas where you'll find a lot of corners and obstacles in your way. In this game, I'm running my custom Contact build M4 mean. and KWA HK45 as my start arm, which is the pistol I'm using at this moment, which I forgot I have put it on safety. But uh, luckily we got the kill. Okay, In this next game, I'm running my VFC MP7 Gen 2 with an x Kodak Tracer unit. You might be a little curious about the digit on the left side of my gun. That is actually the ring unit that communicates with the Tracer unit itself. It will show me how many BBs I have left in the magazine with many other features such as FPS and ROF. It gives you more like a halo looking effect that makes it more futuristic so I like it a lot. It's actually helpful. Okay, this is kind of a funny moment. Here's what happened. So I saw this guy sticking his gun out, so I shot him right away. And then I saw the other guy standing behind him, so I thought I got him too, that's what I thought, because I saw him shook. But then this happened, I saw him again after I was hit. I'm not saying he's a cheer, probably because he didn't feel it, so uh, it's not a big deal. I 
at this point, my teammate and I were trying to take over the stairs that connect the first floor and the second floor, but it was flooded with enemies while I only have two HK45 magazines with me, so it was pretty hard. So there's actually one more enemy behind him, so obviously I would shoot him, but instead I shot the dead guy in the lake, so I was apologizing for it. So this is the last game of the day, and it is also where I eliminated the whole team happened. So I was actually trying to sneak behind this guy and bangle him, or it is called Mercy in the US, I believe. But then I saw a head popping out with the gun beating towards me. So much in the board. So that's it for the clips of the game. I'll see you on the next one. Peace. Oh my god,